Mega Gander on back there. Uh, good buddy Tim is uh, passed out already. But uh, we've got, what do you say, miles? Another four, four and a half hours? Yeah, like four, that four plus hours to go. Yeah. yeah. Check in later. So first cookout trip, what do you guys think? Pretty good. Better than my local park where I steal food. <laughs> <laughs> tell what the residue is made out of and it's just everywhere somebody left their coat so, in on the nightstand so tim how'd i do picking a hotel there's one bed three dudes yeah our our two bed hotel room has one bed oh <laughs> don't, don't look back there don't look back there let's go look that back I did good. Yo, all right. <laughs> Let's see now. Yo, they got ballet sports. I think yeah, I can order. count the pixels <laughs> on the television. Let's see if I can fix this. This is Quality ridiculous. Hotel. Time for dinner. Perfect. All right, Miles. Uncle Bobby's wings and beer. What do you think? So insightful. Uncle Bobby's is pretty good. I haven't seen Uncle Bobby yet. <laughs> the best part about our hotel, we are in walking distance to a liquor store. I kind of feel like if I have to buy one of these, it'd be the, the big one. Yeah, Saki. Japanese. Shot for the night. Come bye. Oh yeah. It's been over 20 minutes. I could just stand here and watch this for hours. All right, so it's about 8.30 in the morning. Uh, I think we went to red around 2.30 or so. Um, I'm up, ready to go. Now it's time to wake up these sleepy heads. So yesterday when we left Daytona, it was about 70 degrees or so. Um, it's currently 35 up here in Georgia. Honestly feels great. Super excited for today. Breakfast at the Chick-fil-A Druid's Grill. Fried pickles at Chick-fil-A was not something I expected, but very good. It takes two knives and it takes it out of the top. I was thinking about it. I was like, how can I eat with it? All right, we have arrived. Um, it's very windy, so I don't know if any of this audio is going to come through at all. Probably. It's also very cold. All right, so pass is acquired. Now time to go spend money. Let me get a sweet roll. Whoa, free stuff. I know, mashed potatoes. Best thing right here on the planet. So, Miles, how are you enjoying your NASCAR experience so far?
one in the books. Uh, we sat on pit road, watched. No, it's not a photo. That's not a photo. Yeah, we were on pit road, and now we're on the blue. So we were on pit stands. road for the truck race. Now we're sitting in the stands watching these Absolutely different views. Should be a good time. I think we literally sat down five minutes ago and the food's already here. Yeah, pretty good service. How was the food? We're on our third basket of chips, so I think it was pretty good. <laughs> Alright, we had to grab the fried ice cream. Fried ice cream. Hell yeah. We just got back and Talladega Ice is on. And I'm pumping my <laughs> and he's gonna be pumping these matches for the next hour. It's a chilly 31 degree morning up here in Georgia, and uh, we're 
packing up the car and getting ready to go to breakfast. Had to hit Bojangles. All right, Tim, first first Bojangles visit, what do you think? Bojangles, mm. biscuits pretty solid. Dang it. <laughs> it's not a photo, no. Biscuits pretty good, chicken tastes awesome. It's nice and spicy. Hell yeah. Should be our last fuel stop until we get back into town. It's still cold, it's still very cold. So to end off the trip, we had to hit the good old Taco Bell by the house. And uh, they told us they just had someone throw drinks and food because <laughs> they were mad. Good stuff. All right, we made it back home. Tim, what'd you think of the trip? Trip was good, first big race. Uh, we got to see two for one, so that was pretty awesome. Um, I think uh, I would do it again for sure. Uh, maybe Talladega next month? Who knows? We'll see. <laughs> All right, so we're back. What'd you think? It was a good experience. I haven't honestly seen a truck race in a long time, even on television. So I had a great time. I'm glad we got to go to the pits. And then the perspective from the banking was really cool up top in the grandstands too. And I wish I could have been there for the cup race, but I'm exhausted and I feel like I had a hell of a weekend, so. Yeah. If you'd like to win this Volante steering wheel, head to racecourstuff.com. All the rules for the contest are on the website. Check it out. Bye.